So what does it do in the body? Well, what we have discovered is that resveratrol works on a gene which is called SIRT1, and this is a gene that controls the aging process. Resveratrol seeks out that gene and switches it on. And with that gene activated in the mouse on the right by a high dose of resveratrol, she quickly turned into a mini Olympian, running twice as far as the untreated mouse on the left. And they were eating a high fat diet, a fatty diet, and they lived just as long as a lean, healthy mouse, which means that they didn't get heart disease, cancer, even osteoporosis, and they lived 30% longer. Can you do this in humans? We have the same exact gene. And we think that resveratrol could have similar benefits in people. Realizing the blockbuster potential for his new pill, Sinclair teamed up with biotech entrepreneur Chris Westfall, together raising more than $100 million for further research. And we think that we can increase healthy lifespan. So if you're in your 80s, you'll be behaving as if you were in People your 50s. People will live longer, healthier lives. And you're talking especially now about diabetes and Alzheimer's? So the major killers of Western society are exactly the diseases that should be able to be treated with the drugs we're developing. Well, you know what, doctor? Cheers. Cheers.